Chairman, your questions and concerns will be... Today, it's an open-line radio talk show in Port Hawkesbury. The unemployment is really high around here, and there's nothing. And, you know, what, what's going to happen? Like, Even with your difficulty and, and the struggle you're having right now, don't allow uh, election and politicians to, uh, to fill you up with a lot of uh, uh, promises now that there's going to be... Shows like these are meat and potatoes to a politician, and, and a and chance to pound out the message. Uh, we are the only province in Canada that hasn't had any increase in provincial taxes of any kind of province. I talked taxes to are his message day in and day out. That as long as I am premier in your province, we will not raise taxes. As long as I'm premier, I will not raise provincial taxes. As long as I'm premier, we will not increase provincial taxes in Nova Scotia. I the Tories are jouts. Wherever he goes, Cameron stops for a visit at the local paper or radio station. There's only one taxpayer, so just shifting. In fact, they're so anxious, they invited themselves to this morning's open line show. The Tories admit they have some catching up to do. One of the mistakes that uh, I've made the past two years is not to communicate uh, enough. Uh, the station is only too happy to oblige. A visit by the Premier is a big deal. It's very rare that uh, in this community we would get someone of the high profile of uh, a political figure such as Don Cameron. So it really gives the station a good profile. Cameron has these planned almost every day in the campaign. So expect to see more of your Premier coming to a radio or cable television station near you. Paul Withers, CBC News, Port Hawkesbury.